What is going on guys, Casual Savage here and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to create a teleport effect in Sony Vegas. Now just before I get into this video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. So I have the clip you saw at the start, this is the raw footage of it and as you can see, it's just me walking onto the screen, staying in one area, doing an action and pretending to be teleported. As you can see, I just simply walked to the other position and I was looking at the camera to see if I was in shot. Just like that, and that is how simple it is. Now one thing you need to do in order for this effect to work, make sure you have the background or where you're going to be standing by itself, so you're not in shot. As you can see, mine was pretty difficult and I only noticed this when I came to edit, is that it's blurred out and the camera really wasn't focusing the best. So I have to find a frame which is in pretty good quality, which is this one right here. Make sure this is set to best and full and then take a snapshot by pressing this button here. So I've named mine background and it comes to your project's media straight away. Just drag and drop this below the video track and extend it out. I'm now going to trim all this down to the part where I actually make the action or the movement right there. So I'm going to press S on my keyboard to split it and then I'm going to be taking a screenshot of this. So I'm going to go back one keyframe. I'm going to press save snapshot to file. As you can see, I just called this teleport one. It came to our projects media again. I'm going to drag and drop this right here. And now what we do is simply drag on the green screen of the teleport effect on top. So we're going to drag and drop it. Make sure it's above like so. And then I'm going to find the part where I actually put my arms in across, which is literally right there. So then I'm going to find the part where the green screen is starting, which is right here. And now we need to remove this green screen. Now to do that, we're going to head over to video effects. If you don't see it, simply come to view, windows layout and select default layout. So from video effects, you're going to come to chroma key and drag on the default. Then where the color is, come to the color picker and select the background. Now we're not just done just yet and you'll see why in a minute. So we're going to come back to this in a minute. The next thing we need to position this green screen in the right place because as you can see it's just center and it doesn't look the best. So in order to do that we're going to come to the event pan and crop and now what I recommend doing have sync cursor unchecked and simply come across on your timeline a bit so you can see the effect and then just move it into position. So as you can see we need to go to the right like that and make sure it's all centered. As you can see you just need to go a bit more to the right. And if yours is snapping like mine, just uncheck snapping here. And then you can see we can simply put it into perfect position here. So that is done. And as you can see, this is why I said we're going to go back to the chroma key because we have this black line here and this black or dark blue box. So we're going to come to the effects button and we're going to turn up the threshold to get rid of it. Just like that. And now, as you'll see, this should play through perfect. And right where this is fully beamed out, which is right here, we're going to trim this part down where we took the screenshot and you'll notice the background image will take position to give us the effects that we've disappeared and teleported. Now I'm actually going to make this start right there. So I'm going to play this through. And that is what it looks like. And then of course we need to go ahead and get us to teleport back in. So we need to find the part where I am now back in my next position, which is right here. This time we're not going to be screenshotting, we're simply just going to find the position and then we're going to drag the another green screen by pressing Ctrl C, Ctrl V and simply putting it into position. So we're going to do the exact same thing. We don't need to do the chroma key because we copy and pasted it. All we need to do is come to the pan and crop and simply put it in the correct position. So we need to come to the opposite side now which is up here and this time we don't get on screen until this is all in position so right there that is when we're going to come back in screen so we're going to cut this part out and now if i play this from the beginning this is what we have
And that is how you create the teleport effect. Very simple. A bit of impractical jokers on in the background. But anyway, that is how simple it is to create. Just gotta make sure you mess with the green screen. And you also wanna make sure you're positioning the camera at all times. Like I mentioned at the start of the video, if you'd like to request a tutorial, then be sure to leave it in the comments below or ask me on Twitter. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, and peace.